Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video for today and this time I'm taking a look at the zombies first look for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War which I feel like I've, I said like three different titles there uh, but this is the zombies mode uh, they were having their first look today and honestly I actually forgot they were doing this uh, so I just got a shower I turned on my computer and it said hey and I was like hey and it says zombies I'm like oh yeah I forgot uh, so anyway uh, only about nine minutes, so not too long. They're gonna show off the zombies. I should Tell everybody I'm not into the lore of the zombies mode. I would love to get into the lore I'm sure there's videos out there. I could watch uh, I actually I think last year when they're showing zombies off. I think some people um, Or maybe it was two years ago. Uh, they showed they, they sent me like like oh you can watch this video and this video and it'll, it'll get you caught up with the lore I just never got around to it. Maybe this time I will because I do I'm actually really excited for this game I really am um, for this Call of Duty, I'm really excited. Like, Modern Warfare, I was kind of excited. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. This one, I don't know. Something about it. I mean, it's because it's Black Ops. And I love the first two Black Ops games. And, uh, three, I liked two. I, th I thought that was good. And four was, was a fine multiplayer game. But, uh, this one looks like it's going back to kind of basics, almost. So, uh, we haven't seen the multiplayer too much yet. So, we'll see that eventually, I guess. But, first, zombies. Zombies. I mean, we saw a little bit of multiplayer, but, you know what I mean. More I mean, anyway, let's get to it. All right. Zombies. <laughs> Who could have guessed when the dead first appeared in Call of Duty World of War? Zombies. It us here to today. From that moment, zombies sparked the love for fighting the undead, bringing its unique DNA to the Call of Duty experience. Whether you're playing solo, World or War, working to solve Fun puzzles stuff. or unlock Easter eggs, Facing wave after wave of the undead delivers fast, fun action with just one objective. Survive. Survive. Black Ops Cold War sets the stage for a new zombies experience that not only celebrates our entire zombies heritage, but uses it as an inspiration to build a completely new chapter in our universe. Today, we cover the characters, the backstory, and okay. weapons with members of the like development you... team, some of whom have quite literally helped to build it one zombie at a time. Ooh. But first, let's check out the worldwide premiere of our new Zombies gameplay trailer. Okay. Are we going to get like a cast of like celebrities again? or Because I know, isn't there like two different modes? You get the actual characters and then you get the the cast of characters. All right, let me shut up. Pam, what have you done? Did you get the package? Watch it. Watch the tape. What the hell is that? Uh. Oh, nasty blood. It's happening again. Imagine just showing this to someone that's only played the first Call of Duty. Be like, what the fuck? Roger, moving. Oh, I like this. Actually, like going into a building and. What was that? Nice. Report. What the hell just happened? Call of Duty's got some good remixes of songs. Let's go! Push up Rocket launcher? What does it do? Oh, it's just rocket launcher. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's, I saw the first thing. I was like, oh, that's cool. What does the rocket launcher do? It's just, it's just a rocket launcher. <laughs> Not special. Oh, man. I'm getting like alien vibes from those things. He's still shooting zombies. Ooh. Oh, is that like the BFG? Oh, that's exactly like the BFG. What the hell? <laughs> Damn, the guns are badass in this. Long title, look at that. <laughs> look at that title. Cold Duty Black Ops, Cold War Zombies. <laughs> and 
Juggernaut. I know what that is. Hey, Frank! You can play Frank in it? That's awesome. After so many journeys, so many chapters, with Black Ops Cold War, we're starting fresh, embarking on a completely different story within our universe. Oh, really? Oh, perfect. We've got a new story I can get into there. By different characters. We've got new ways to play. Perfect. Anchored by new ways of progressing. We've got a different time period. Cold yeah. War Zombies wasn't just our opportunity to open up a different chapter. It was our opportunity to elevate Wait, are, are our people going to be upset experience. about that? That's not continuing the story? We call the Machine. The Machine. As we set out to build something completely new, we were inspired to pay homage to Zombies' undead roots to celebrate our origin with one of our most familiar and signature locations. Oh, this is uh, from World of War, right? Story, but we're still in that same universe, and this is the next chapter. The, the very end of Black Ops 4, our characters sacrificed themselves to collapse the multiverse and try and create a singular world where hey. zombies didn't exist. Why are you spoiling, and bro? I mean... They were half right. <laughs> oh, I get only a. Look at the lore of those. This is a Cold War story. What the hell's and going on here? It's driven by a diverse group of organizations and characters. Players are part of Requiem. Yeah, but is Keanu Reeves in it? The international response team led by Weaver. I don't think so. Russian American will be familiar to Black Ops fans. Watch Keanu Reeves is in it. Thank you, arrive and hunt like. for answers. <laughs> the machine will have been ravaged by time. On the surface, you see a boarded up bunker. But below the surface lies a nefarious set of decades old secrets primed to upset the global order. The players will find themselves at odds with a team of Soviet-led rivals known as Omega Group, who are just as interested in studying and harnessing the power of the unexplained anomalies manifesting around the globe. Beyond these two warring groups, they'll encounter characters with unknown agendas who operate in the field, delivering insights and intel on this new world's fiction. The intel you receive and recover is a huge component of our storytelling in Cold War. And for the first time, an innovative new intel system will make content accessible on demand anytime. Okay. There's a lot to uncover that no one's ever seen before. Whoa. Okay. Ah, I got some Let's high. Get into Sorry. Alright, here we go. That starts with delivering all your favorite elements. Relentless round-based action, the pack-a-punch machine, power-up drops, the mystery box, along with the return of some of our classic perks. We've also taken I know a few of these things. I know the mystery box. To let you drop in and have fun faster than ever. The gameplay is classic, but it's going to be tonally quite fresh. Alright. You'll find our updates this year have focused on one thing above all, embracing what makes zombies so much fun. That starts with progression. This year, it's just, it's just the BFG. It's... All of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. That means wherever you play, I'm sure it's in one of the original. Your global rank and weapons zombies. level stays connected. Here we are unlocking weapons and equipment, score streaks that will be usable across the entirety of the game. No more starting with a pistol. Bring in your AR, your SMG. Okay. You're okay, that's cool. And with all weapons boasting rarity with power levels, you can continue to increase your gun's damage potential however you choose. Oh, Every a little RPG a path to become an uber weapon. Okay. You have a lethal, tactical, and support slot. Not only can you craft, pick up, or find equipment and support in zombies. Well, I, have a people, I have a feeling people are not going to be happy about that. Some insanely fun moments. You're going to change the gameplay? Traditionally, not on my watch. The only way out was death. A new expo system solves this. If things get tense and the squad is in trouble, you have the option to expo to a chopper and earn some rewards. But only if you can survive a few more rounds of zombie spawns dialed up to 11. Whoa! Okay. This is shaping up to be our most epic zombie That's kinda cool. Like, you do some Titanfall shit? Or you just get the hell out of there? Post-launch content is gonna be free. As new maps come out, everyone's gonna be able to come along for the journey as we take them through this story. Oh, it's awesome! Everything's gonna be free now? Canon is canon. And we've put a story to rest, but as you comb through this new universe, don't be surprised if some things don't want to stay dead. <laughs> this is the most connected and robust zombies experience in history. It also delivers a first for zombies, a fully cross-play experience with progression systems that tie zombies to the battle pass. We're dropping free post-launch zombies content to the community for the first time as well. So just zombies, not, not multiplayer, right? Journey. We're glad that you could join us. 
for today's first look. I was here. Oh, the great raven in the bottom right. Begins October 8th, first on PS4. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I'll probably play on PS4. I got a PS4. Why not? I might as well. That was good. You know what? They're doing a great job marketing that game. It, it's weird, too, because a month ago, we were like, where the hell is the game? Or a little over a month ago. And now that we've seen a lot. So, <laughs> it's just like, all right. I figured they could they could announce that game a week before it was supposed to come out. And, and it would do fine. Perfectly fine. Um, yeah. So, awesome. Really good. Really cute. Uh, no, there's not that many dislikes at all. I was wondering if people are not going to like the changes to, like... Because I, I don't know how people... We need Elena Sigmund back for the music in this game? Okay. We need to play as Ronald Reagan at some point. Yeah, I'm waiting for them to, to show the... Because the, there's always, like, one mode where... You have one mode that's the story mode, and then the other one's, like, the goofy one, isn't it? Where they we, they get, like, celebrities or whatever. And it wasn't, like, Ron Perlman in one, and, uh... Shit, who else? Oh, my God. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, there's a lot of, like, pretty big name actors for the most part in, in it. Um, anyway, whatever. Uh, so that's Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Zombies first look. Uh, it looks great. I'm actually excited for that. That looks really, really fun. And I'm glad that it doesn't... I, like, every time there's a new Call of Duty game out and there's a zombies mode, I always feel like I'm not going to know what the hell's going on and stuff. Like, I'm glad this one's just going to be like, hey, it's a new story. Just get right into it. And it's also different now. You can take your gun play whatever any gun you want right in the beginning it seems like you can level up until you get to an uber weapon which is kind of cool um there's a bfg <laughs> which makes me you know that's what doom eternal needed it needed a mode where it was just like zombies except with demons obviously where you and a, a couple other buddies are not the doom slayer but you know like like maybe another part of his uh his marine buddies or whatever uh, and, uh, you have to just survive wave after wave. Like, that's what, that's what that game needed. I think that actually was in Doom 2016. Uh, I don't think it was, like, multiplayer, but I think you could play a survival mode. But, uh, whatever. I guess that's kind of what the multiplayer is, but not really. It's not exactly what I want. Anyway, cheers. Cheers to Treyarch. Good job. Anyway, there you go. And Raven. Shout out to Raven. Maybe one of my favorite underrated games ever, Singularity. Go play that game. It was awesome. Anyway, Raven's great. So there you go. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Till next time. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.